honor in the, in the construction of the basilica. The name of this site is Early Christian Small Basilica. It was found in uh, um, several years ago. It was uh, restored, uh, and this is how we we can preserve the mosaics heritage that this city holds galore. We could say because uh, this is one of the several sites which illustrate the the art uh, of the ancient people of the representatives of. A mosaics school uh, that uh, we had in Philippopolis in the third, fourth centuries AD. The name Basilica is, uh, signifies uh, a religious Christian temple, so it was a kind of a church uh, of a, the style of a basilica with uh, a nave, with, with ales, with an artex. There, there are special rules in, uh, in the construction of, or in, in the architectural sense of this kind of uh, buildings. So uh, yes, this was a small basilica because it was uh, positioned close to the wall uh, near the the roads and uh, the people uh, think that uh, the travelers could have a place where to thank God for their safe journey but uh, the town the city of Philippopolis in trace in that time had also the huge basilica which was which is really um, a masterpiece of this kind of art Teatrul roman din Plovdiv a fost construit în anul 90 la noastră pe vremea împăratului Domitian. Ce se poate spune despre această clădire este faptul că ea a fost excavată timp de 30 de ani până în anul 1979 și este cea mai bine păstrată clădire de acest fel din Europa. Pentru Go Next, Adrian Boioglu. First of all, for us it's very important that we work closely with the local authorities and the business and this is why uh, those are one of the main measures in terms of cooperation that we have set in our sustainable tourism strategy till 27. But not only the strategy is important, the important is that we have a clear action plan, uh, uh, how we are uh, cooperating with all the sectoral institutions that are relevant to tourism as transport, environment, uh, education, social services, everything has his role uh, in uh, the last tourism product that we offer. And uh, what is uh, our uh, really um, key focus uh, to convert Bulgaria into a round destination is really the cultural and historical tourism that we have focused since 2015. Uh, the ministry, by the way, as a separate administration was established on 7th of November 2014. Uh, so we elaborated nine uh, um, cultural historical destinations plus seven spine wellness destination and vino and um, wine and culinary uh, 12 destination so we try to combine the main summer and winter project with all those different uh, other um, sectors in tourism that we have and to make what we offer more attractive. Well, Romanian visitors are uh, one of the most important for Bulgaria and I would like to use your uh, camera to thank every single Romanian visitor that visited our beautiful country and that will continue doing that. We will welcome them with a great hospitality and quality and we will continue improving because Romania for us is very important and not only as a tourism market but also we are strategic partners, we are friends. We have with my colleagues uh, uh, from the Romanian Ministry of Tourism a long-term cooperation. Uh, we have signed a, a memorandum of understanding in tourism with concrete actions. We are very focused and work together on common tourism projects, in particular elaborating uh, the Danube River Basin uh, based on the Danube strategy. And also we have a cross-border cooperation program, Interreg 5, that we are uh, developing together. One of the, the main uh, projects 
we have are related with the cultural observatories that are focused on the cultural heritage plus the education, the universities that are really uh, uh, the institution that can bring us back in our legacy. And then we transform that as a legend that is very attractive. First of all, um, tell us how important it is for the city to be named European Capital of Culture for 2019. It's very important because it is a brand that European Union gives uh, to the cities that earn the title with a different uh, the scale of battle between the city of a country. Well, if you'd like to be um, uh, surprised, in a very good way uh, to, to see a very nice event at the Asian Theatre of Plovdiv or a rock festival at the Royal Canal or jazz concert or to dance swing on the streets. If you like good wine, if you like fresh and nice food and if you would like to have fun, you should drive just uh, another um, 500 kilometers, but since you come once, you'll come again, definitely. What was new this year, um, knowing your experience from the previous years? So, International Meeting of Tourism is a part of cultural calendar, of, of the events calendar from Plovdiv. It's a traditional event. Uh, this year uh, we show uh, the new hotels in the city. The accent is uh, the Bishop's Basilica uh, Filippopo. Uh, the tourist object, object uh, will be opened maybe in 2020, in the middle of 2020. So uh, we try to, um, to show what will be in 2020.